Hi and welcome to the channel. Today I'd like to talk about a uh, RV solar system transfer switch. Is it needed? Well, I'll leave that decision up to you. On the top of our motorhome we have just over 2,000 watts of solar. And if you'd like to see the information on that system, we have a video on our channel. Please check it out. Also, if you would, please like and subscribe to our channel. Let's us know how we're doing. Now inside the rig I have this cabinet in which it contains all of our uh, batteries and inverter and charge controllers, wiring and so forth. But uh, again, we're talking about uh, a transfer switch today. So just to, to kind of give you what we use, our power comes from the batteries. We have six 100 amp hour batteries with lots of dust on them. The power comes through this cable to this disconnect switch, through that fuse block, and then into our inverter. Now this is a 3500 watt pure sine wave inverter. Now the power coming out of the inverter, the AC power, you see this white wire here and you can kind of see the green wire while the black wire is in there as well. That, uh, that goes down and around and goes over to that circuit breaker right there. Now from that circuit breaker it goes outside to a plug that we uh, put our uh, plug our shore power into our shore power cable that is so when we want to plug our shore power into a pedestal we shut that circuit breaker off obviously we'll shut down our inverter and then go outside and unplug so what we have done is we have two disconnects the circuit breaker and the plug on the outside of the rig. Now we're outside and you can, well it's a little tough to see, let me see if I can get closer here. There, that cable right there, that cable right there is the one that comes from the circuit breaker on the inside, goes to that socket and the plug, the shore power plug right here is plugged into it. So like I said, when we want to plug in the shore power, we turn off the circuit breaker on the inside and then come out here and unplug the shore power cable. We have, uh, we have achieved two disconnects from our inverter before our shore power cable gets plugged into a pedestal. And you say, well, what about your generator? Well, with our onboard generator, the manufacturers... And, and I believe this is true with all RVs that have a manufactured installed generator, also has a built-in transfer switch. So when you turn on your generator and it comes up to voltage, that transfer switch automatically disconnects the shore power cable, which disconnects it from your inverter. Just to be safe though, I always turn off the circuit breaker. If I forget to turn the circuit breaker off, this transfer switch is the fail-safe. It disconnects from the shore power cable, preventing any power from backfeeding into our inverter. Now, we've been using this system for about four years. Before we bought the motorhome, we had a travel trailer. And I had this same system installed in the travel trailer, and it worked flawlessly there. And once we transferred over to the motorhome here, the same situation. We have not had any issues with power. So do you need an additional transfer switch? That's up to you. If it makes you feel better or more secure, comfortable, whatever, go for it. Um, for me, I just didn't see the expense because I already have two disconnects in hand, so to say, so to speak. Um, my hand is my transfer switch. As soon as I unplug that shore power cable, I know that no power is going to go back to my inverter. Even if I forget to turn off the circuit breaker, forget to turn off the inverter, there is no way that the power can backfeed from my shore power cable into that inverter. So again, uh, I leave it up to you. Uh, for me, I just didn't see the expense or the need. Uh, if, you, uh, if you would, again, please subscribe to our channel. Let us know how we're doing. If you have any comments or questions, leave them. We try to answer all 
comments left for our channel. Again, thank you very much for taking your time to stop by and view this video. We appreciate it because we know how valuable your time is. Enjoy and have a great day.